Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This channel is going to be all about periods and period supplies. I'm going to be talking about products and doing reviews on a whole variety of different products and subscription boxes and all of that jazz relating to periods. So I decided that the first video for my channel should be a period storage collection video. I keep my period supplies in this box. It has a cupcake print on and it simply slides under my dresser. I have a few products in here. These are just things that I've been using recently, but I have um, a few extra products that I've just purchased, but I'm going to be talking about those in a haul video um, because they are a specific brand. So I'm going to get started. I'm just going to move this box to one side and pull out the products. So firstly in my box, I keep my at work period kit. I will also have a video coming up on this and this is just what I pop into my handbag when I'm going to be at work for the day or out of the house and I'm on my period. The next product I have is this pack of Lilettes. These are 12 long ultra towels with wings. Um, it says they are new, they are in this bright pink packaging and the pads look like this is crumpled, this is open, so I've looked at it. But the pads um, inside, these pads look like this. They are super soft, but the packaging rips really easily when you open it, although it does rip very quietly. I have this pack of Always Soft and Fit towels. These are normal with wings and you get 14 in a pack. I am not the biggest fan of Always pads, but these ones are actually quite comfortable and they are unscented, which is what I prefer. The pad is just this plain white packaging with a green tab. And this is what it looks like inside. And this is what it looks like inside. I have a spare pack of Femme Fresh wipes. I like these for my going out period kits for freshening up. And I usually buy a couple of packs at a time and they are on special offer. Now, I know I said I'm not the biggest fan of Always, but I do have this pack of ultra secure nighttime pads. I had to grab these in an emergency one evening. And um, so I will of course use them up. I've only used a couple out of here. These pads are in the bright blue packaging and they look like this. They do have a really lovely shape to them, especially if you are a back bleeder. I do have a few loose always ultra long towels. I, I think I don't have the packet. Um, these are scented and I tend to react to these. So these have just been sitting at the bottom of my stash for quite some time. I think I'm just going to give these to my friend who does use them and like them because I will not be using them. Next, I have this box of Time of the Month Organic Cotton Day Pads with Wings. I'm going to be doing a full video on this company. They are a really great company. They do organic pads and they offer a subscription service. They are, however, quite expensive. Each box of pads is, I think, around th two or three pounds and you only get eight. Um, but I do have some to try. Um, the day ones are light blue. So I have one box of these left. The pads look like this. This was a loose one that I have, just this white packaging with a, um, a sticky tab. And inside they look like this. I then have two boxes of the time of the month night pads. 
the night pads are in this pale blue packaging and they are a lot thicker than the other ones. I tend to use these during the day if I want a pad that feels a little bit more secure and they work absolutely fine as a day pad, they don't feel too bulky. Inside, they look like this. The final time of the month product I have is their box of 28 organic cotton panty liners for daily use. They look like this. If I can open the box. Um, they come face down, they're not folded, and the liners look like this. also have these always dailies these are um extra long plus panty liners these are really good at the start and the end of my period and these are one of the always products i do like i do like their liners i just wish that they weren't scented so the i do have two menstrual cup this is the maluna cup in the pouch and this is what it looks like. I have cut the stem off. I have used this a reasonable amount. I definitely prefer pads, but these are really good if I do want some internal protection or if I'm swimming. I have found the Maluna cup quite easy to insert. Now I've got the hang of it, although it did take a little bit of practice. And finally, I have a newer menstrual cup, which I have not tried yet. This is the Lena cup. It comes in this coloured... It comes in this really pretty coloured pouch. And the cup is pink. I haven't trimmed the stem or tried this yet, um, but I will possibly do so at some point in the near future. So here is everything that was in my period box. This is obviously more than you need for one cycle. This will last me a while. I know I kept saying throughout that I'm not keen on always products and then I showed quite a few. And I think the reason why I do have a few is because I haven't been using them very much. I must just get on with using them up. Um, but like I said, the exception is I do like the always dailies panty liners. I must see if they do an unscented version though. I will be doing a review on the time of the month organic cotton pads very soon, so stay tuned for that. If you want to hear more about any other products mentioned in this video, then leave a comment below. Like this video if you liked it, and subscribe to this channel for more period-related videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.